Alright. Today's gonna be working on the edit of the new song from yesterday. Uh, this hour is the running title at the moment. I don't know if I'm gonna change that, but I want to edit some of the vocals just to tighten it up. It's a bit difficult when I'm the only one kind of doing it. So I'm always going back and repeating like long takes. I can't do quick cuts to get the perfect take, but honestly, it's fine. You just gotta work around that. Um, I'll probably try now adding different elements to this with instrumentation, maybe doubling, bring the mandolin in as well. That'd be cool. <laughs> Pieces, another puzzle gone unsolved. To spiral is a shame. Not a hole I'll feel the same. I hear, I hear Tom's more than anything. Yeah, I hear as well. I also just feel like it's like very, like a very loose kind of sway to it. Maybe one more? Yeah, yeah. Oh, the ambient ones are the hard ones. Yeah, because you've got to know when not to play or when yeah. to play them, so yeah. I, you're definitely, like, you're there.
Overall, this whole process has just been so enjoyable and instructive. I've learnt so much through just re-recording this song over and over again. Every time, learning something new, as well as being more confident with just hitting that record button, even if I don't know where to begin. One of the biggest deficiencies in my skill set is production, and it's something that I'm working on day in and day out. But I know that as long as I remain consistent and self-aware, and I'm trying to improve, I will slowly reach the outcome that I would like, which is to be able to execute the ideas that I have in my head and to finish the songs that I have written down and bring it to life so I can share that with other people. And bridging this gap is extremely difficult, but I know in order for me to achieve the outcome that I want, which is to share music with everyone else, I need to keep showing up daily and keep making these incremental improvements.